Hi there, wanted to do a quick q and I've got a question on Facebook from Keith Jones, who says, why, when your aircraft has two IFR-capable area nav systems, I assume he means the 530 and the 430 GNS Garmin's, do you spend so much time using an iPad and a stock on the window traffic box? Sky Echo. Both of these seem to take up huge amounts of time with reliability issues, yet seem to offer nothing that a flight plan loaded into the double GPS installation and a good lookout can't provide. Okay, quick answer to that. Um, I'm talking about VFR flight here and all my flights on video so far have been VFR flights and I find Sky Demon by far the best VFR moving map navigation device for speed, convenience and ease for planning and for flying. Uh, this just doesn't come even close uh, in terms of notification of airspace, no TAMs, that kind of stuff, danger areas. Um, secondly, um, I don't agree that a good lookout can provide the same uh, additional support. I mean, I do a good lookout anyway, but the conspicuity device is, is a two-way thing. It gives, it sends out an ADSB signal so other aircraft pick me up and I get their position, track and altitude plotted on my Skydeam moving map, which is just amazing. It's like having a radar. Obviously it only works for aircraft that are transmitting ADSB out. Um, but uh, he questions the Sky Demon on the iPad and Sky Echo. Sky Demon has been almost faultlessly reliable. In one video, it did actually crash on me, but it's only ever crashed on me once in years. Uh, the Sky Echo, only once have I lost, lost the Wi-Fi connection. Happened on the same flight as I lost COM1 on my, uh, on my GNS 530. Both were fixed by recycling the power. Um, otherwise, the GPS location on the Sky Echo can be patchy. Um, so... I would much rather have Sky Demon on my iPad here, moving map while I'm flying, than rely just on that for VFR flight. Um, but if there was, as he suggests, an alternative to a Sky Echo that gave me other aircraft's position on my moving map, I would love to know about it. Please let me know in the comments below. Thanks for the question, question Keith. Um, and also thanks for asking if you can use my videos with your students as an example of what not to do. <laughs> I think that's a, a dubious honour, but you're very welcome. Bye-bye.